Hey guys, we are gonna dye our Easter eggs today and we're testing out something new. If y'all remember about two years ago, we did how to dye Easter eggs using Kool-Aid. If y'all wanna watch that video, I'll link it up down in the description below. Y'all can go and check that out. So this year, we're gonna try and dye Easter eggs. Using fruits and vegetables, all natural. Right now we have purple cabbage. All right. And Amelia and I chopped it and tore it and broke it up. And I put a lot in there because from what I read, the more plant material you have, then the darker your eggs will come out. So we're gonna put our duck eggs in with the cabbage. Go get your stool. Go get your stool and you can watch. So we are gonna add a little bit of vinegar. You need about a <laughs> tablespoon of vinegar per one cup of water. The vinegar helps to um, break down the calcium in the eggs, which allows the dye to kind of penetrate. There's a science experiment that I did where uh, I broke down the eggshell and it breaks it all the way down to where it becomes bouncy. I'll link that up down below too if you guys wanna go and watch that. So we got vinegar in, got some water. Now how long do, do you have to let this boil for once it starts boiling it's for about 15 minutes what uh other foods have you read about that you can do this to dye eggs uh we're gonna do onion skins which surprisingly make their eggs like pretty orange uh -huh. uh we're gonna try carrot we're gonna see if we can find some blackberries we know they're not gonna be like neon right yeah but we wanted to try doing it just, just to see stuff what that it, we have yeah. around the house right what do you think about this amelia you don't know? We're gonna see if we can turn our eggs purple. You think they're gonna come out purple? Mm -hmm. yeah. Is it boiling yet at least? Yeah, it's boiling. Oh, yeah, it's been okay. For a yeah. while. Mm -hmm. We got five more minutes, but we haven't had like no color change. Oh wow. Taking them out. Water definitely turned a purple color. It turned a little bit, didn't it? Yeah, bluish. Yeah, bluish and purple. It definitely feels different. You can tell the vinegar was going into the eggshell. Yeah. And you, there's definitely a color difference there. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. It's weird that it changes color. After like it got like it you can like watch it darker, yeah. All right, guys, we figured something out. So we're looking at these eggs, and they look they look blue. Krista figured up a little science experiment that she could do to find out why that is happening. Cabbage juice is called an indicator, like a pH indicator. Mm -hmm. So if you put something acidic in it, I think it stays purple. That's why it's still purple with the vinegar. But if you add a base to it. So we're gonna get some of the cabbage juice. Come see Amelia, come bring your stool, it's gonna be cool. Mommy's gonna give you a spoonful of baking soda. Baking soda's a base. <laughs> That's a pH greater than seven. <gasps> what color did it turn? Blue. Whoa. And so that's why our eggs are blue. I guess because the outside of the eggshell is like a base, uh -huh. basic. Yeah. Um, once it's removed from the vinegar, it turns more. Right. That's our purple cabbage. If you guys have any suggestions for other foods that we could put uh, in the water to dye with, leave those down in the comments below and uh, maybe we'll get some ideas from you guys. Make sure to click that subscribe button. We definitely appreciate that. All right, guys. Good night. Alrighty guys, your previous would you rather. Would you rather eat snot on your steak or eat a worm in your pasta? I tallied up all the votes and you guys prefer to eat snot on your steak. I think you guys just like the look of that steak more than you do the pasta there, eh? <laughs> Alright, your would you rather for this week. Would you rather live on the moon or live on the bottom of the ocean? Click your pictures there to cast your vote, and whenever we do another video, I will let you guys know which one you guys prefer by which one y'all click the most. And whenever you click that, that'll take you to our channel page. You can watch more of our videos, which we definitely appreciate. If you want the next video, make sure to click that subscribe button so that you stay up to date with us. If you want to see the behind the scenes of this video, make sure to click that video right there playing in the middle where we dyed a lot more eggs with different things. So make sure to go and check that out if you like this video. Video. And if you want to help support us, you like the video, you want to share some love, and you need to buy something through Amazon, use our link. Click the annotation or down in the description, and we get a few dimes.